Proper store is supposed to start at the beginning. Ain't so simple with this one. Now here's a kid whose whole world got all twisted, leaving him stranded on a rock in the sky. He gets up, sets off for the bastion, where everyone agreed to go in case of trouble. The ground forms up under his feet as it point in the way. He don't stop to wonder why. Finds his lifelong friend just lying in the road. Well, it's a touching reunion. He sees what's left of the rippling walls. Years of work undone in an instant. In the calamity. And then, he falls to his death. I'm just fooling. That a survivor. No man. It's a gas fella. Forced out from underground. It pops him good. Fella got a piece of it though. Kid just rages for a while. out of the sky. Ain't a gift from the gods, but it'll have to do. Kid's worked up quite a thirst by now, so that fountain looks real inviting. Sometimes you just need a drink. A school of squirts tunnels up around him. Must have fled here from the mines. Finds a memento from a girl he knew. Always used to fancy her. It's a wonder the old saloon's still standing. Used to have the nicest view. He sets foot inside one of Selandia's famous watering holes. Inside's old Rondi, the bartender. The calamity got him for his drinking meal. <laughs> then he finds his trusty shield. Rondi always wanted his ashes scattered here. But just as he's getting a handle on it, the security takes him for a petty thief. <laughs> Special delivery. Gas fellas. <laughs> Windbags start turning up for last call. Start coming out of the woodwork. A big old fella pops out in front of the kid. Kids 
sees the weight of the bastion out the window. It's a bit of a drop. He gets a good look at things on his way down. He lands on top of a breaker's bow, and it ain't broke. Spies a good perch for some target practice. He knows he should draw the string all the way back. The kid pockets a memento from a breaker, once the fastest man in the land. is the emergency defenses still work. Bad news is they aim it for the kid. Arsenal, the tough part of town. One sip of the spirits in that distillery, and the kid'll feel like a new man. tools for the job. Crazy in a couple of corn bins. Once taught the kid good manners, 
He never used them, though. An old ferry barge sends the kid on his way. The Bastion's real close now. Now the kid sees something stranger still, his mind races. Did anybody else survive? Sure enough, he finds another. He finds me. We talk for a spell. I try to let the kid down gently. This is the bastion, all right. Except no one else showed up. All I tell him is to set that core of his on the monument there, then watch. There's a bit of the Bastion's power in that crest, enough to point the way to the cores. And just like that, the Bastion comes alive. Starts growing again, growing stronger. Kid's gotta put its power to good use. Now the Bastion can send him even farther into the wild unknown. Kid ponders what to build. The kid don't know what's out there waiting for him. The Skyway. Now the kid can ride the wind to distant lands. Makes time to sample spirits from my personal supply.
Where whiskey has no scent, but tastes like a peppered boot heel, it's not for everyone. Ain't always much to say. Now he lands at the intersection between bad and wrong. Ought to be a core down one of these twisted streets. But which one? He heads for the squirt steps. Won't be no field trip this time. side, where windbags used to keep the local forge. They ain't pleased. No coal or alloy left to pay for the reference. Inside the forge, he can fine-tune those instruments of his. Lifelong friends looking fit to keep on fighting. With a good length of me's gut, that bow's like new again. Core ain't here neither, so he's got to guess again. Odd place to find the likes of Percy the Snitch. Never much cared for that big wide grin of his. alike. Kids wondering the same thing. And there it is. But it's locked down tight in an alloy cage. A blustery old foreman is keeping his fellas in check. Almost like he's showboating from the crowd. And now there's a new marshal in town. He hears the whole place groan, but it's too tough to fall. Might as well check the other side streets before leaving this hole. Yeah. 
delicious in just about anything. Except for this. It's quick for slicing and light enough to throw. Rambunctious squirts can be tamed. Squirts don't make the best of friends, but they can be useful in a pinch. Then squirts just don't know when to quit. comes back, just like I knew he would. The core hums in his pack, the monuments calling for it. The windbags used to be alright, then the calamity took the floor out from under him. Kid does it again. Only fair he decides what we build next. <laughs> Squirt cider will toughen you right up. Too bad about the musty aftertaste. The bastion's a place of peace. But we can hold our own if we have to. A repeater goes with a hammer better than a box of nails. Picked up traces of other cores while the kid was out. In better days, the melting pot was sealed tighter than the skin on the squirt. plans 
to survive the calamity. It had to be stab weeds. Blasting things hurt like a broken heart. There's a core, he figures it ought to be deeper down. He cuts down every stab weed like there's gotta be a prize for it. Core stuck inside one of those fancy cages. No breaking a cage like that, but the kid tries anyway. Gotta find a way to spring it open. Except the stuff lying around is downright dangerous. Throws a switch. Now what could possibly go wrong? Quite a bit, as it turns out. The cage starts lifting from the core ever so slow. All kid can do is wait. Shipments start falling in. Scores more bad. Some spring to the kid's defense. Judging by the movement of the cage, it's gonna take a little while. I still remember the look on his face after that one. The 
the old world's finished, but the new world's just getting started. A lot of things need fixing up in this world, and we can start right here. Turns out those old bones still have some spark in them. Old wood oil and that blade shines like a light. <laughs> Folks voyage crossed the boundless sea to found Ceylandia. It was good living here for a while. Too careful these days. Windbag Ranch was built for gathering squirt extract and copious supply. Ain't nothing more healthful. <laughs> 